What is going on everybody? Joe Oceanside here, and today I'm in the Florida Keys. I'm gonna be testing out some red filters for the GoPro Hero 8. I wanna see if using a red filter on the camera makes the colors look better. So these are the color filters I'm using today. This is made by Sunsun, and they go directly onto the GoPro dive housing, or what's called the super suit. So basically the deeper you go in water, the more red lights get filtered out. So you lose the colors as you go down deeper. Now a red filter is one way to bring some of the colors back and make the footage look better. So we're gonna try that out today. And also we're gonna try the camera out with no red filter, and then we're gonna color correct it on the computer. So we're gonna see what looks better, GoPro with a red filter or GoPro without a red filter and computer color correction. So let's get in and let's have a look. I'm gonna free dive down to about 15 feet, right where we start to lose some of the red colors in the water. Now here it is with no filter. It's kind of washed out. Everything's kind of an aqua color. Looks okay, but not great. I'm gonna go ahead and snap the red filter on the GoPro now. Now here's what it looks like. We have the reds, oranges, yellows. It looks pretty good. It looks kind of dull, but the colors look pretty nice. The skin tones look good. I like it. Here it is side by side. What do you think? Which one looks better to you? I like the colors of the red filter. It looks pretty good. Now I'm gonna go ahead, take the red filter off and just do a computer color correction only. Now look at this, this looks fantastic. I think this probably looks better than with the red filter. So let's go back to red filter, flip the camera around. I'm gonna film some of the reef and the fish here. It looks pretty good. We have purples, we have all the colors. The reef actually looks really good with the red filter. Let's pop the red filter off. Now look at that, everything's aqua, washed out, just blue color. Here they are side by side. Which one do you think looks better? I like the red filter in this case. All right, now let's take a look at no filter and just computer color correction only. It looks pretty good. It, it probably almost looks as good as with the red filter. Let's go back to no filter here on the Jesus statue, aqua washed out. Let's pop on the red filter. Those colors look pretty cool. There's kind of a purpley hue in the background, beautiful colors on the statue. Now here it is side by side. Which one do you think looks better? I definitely like the red filter in this case. All right, I'm gonna take off the filter and we're back to computer color correction only. And this looks really good. My only issue with this is the background colors are kind of strobing between green and blue. So that's a little distracting, but it looks pretty good though. Here's no filter on a nice reef with a whole bunch of coral and sea fans on it. Pretty washed out, not too many colors. Here's with red filter. Now, this almost looks a little bit overly red, and I think that's because we're pretty shallow here, so we still have a lot of the sunlight. Look at them side by side. So the one on the left, pretty blue. One on the right, a little bit overly red in my opinion, but again, I think that's because we're shallow. Now, here's computer color correction, and I think this is almost perfect. This looks really nice. It look, the colors aren't strobing, changing at all. It looks really good. Everything looks exactly like I saw it when I was out in the water. Now you can see when you have a red filter at the surface, everything's completely red because you're getting all the red from the sun. Now as you drop down deeper, those reds start to go away. So here we are down. Now this looks really good. I like the skin tones, I like the reef colors, and I like the background blue. That looks really good with the red filter. Pop the red filter off. Here we are, and again, all washed out. Everything's just kind of a different shade of aqua. Let's put the red filter back on, and let's go ahead and we'll do a side-by-side. -side. This one, you know, it almost looks a little bit overly red on the red part, so let's see what it looks like with computer. All right, computer color correction looks really good, almost perfect, good skin tones. Okay, I'm gonna show you a whole bunch of clips with just the red filter. If you go ahead, take a look at them and comment below. Tell me what you think. Are they too red? Are they too washed out? Are they too dull? Or do you like the colors? Hey, real quick, if you're enjoying the video, please hit the like button. And also, if you enjoy this type of content, underwater adventures, underwater gear, GoPros, things like that, then go ahead and subscribe to the channel for more great videos to come. Okay, I'm gonna look at your comments and see what you thought about the red filter. So now let's try computer color correction only. I'm gonna show you some clips of no filter and then I'm gonna go ahead and throw computer color correction on it. And let me know what you think about these clips with computer color correction. Now this computer color correction software is called the Dive Plus app. You can actually have it on your phone or your tablet. 
And it works amazing, man. This thing is almost like magic the way that it fixes the colors. I really love using this app. So in one of my upcoming videos, I wanna show you guys how to use the Dive Plus app to fix your underwater photos and videos. Now I took a cool photo of this Jesus statue. We're gonna look at it four ways. Here it is with no filter. Here it is with red filter. Actually, this looks pretty dull. I'm gonna show you with no filter and computer color correction. That looks amazing. That looks really, really nice. And this is really crazy here. Here's the red filter plus the computer color correction. And look at this, it's really oversaturated and some really cool colors. Let me know in the comments below, what do you think about the red filter? Do you think the footage looks better with the red filter on the GoPro Hero 8 or do you prefer the footage once it's been run through the Dive Plus app for computer color correction? And let me know what you think about this video. Do you enjoy looking at GoPro gear? And do you enjoy underwater videos? If you do, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Also, please like this video. It really helps me out on this channel. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you get out there and take some footage of your own and explore.